myself here um, like I can't believe I'm actually in Venice I'm here now look at this I'm in I've been wanting to do this for like 10 years and I'm here and I'm like properly lost in Venice which is like basically all I ever wanted to do I I just, I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This is amazing. I feel so happy with my life right now. <laughs> some lunch. First I need to find some like internet. Ooh, light. Hi. Just got spied by somebody. Oh well. But yeah, I'm gonna go find some lunch. <laughs> like so many tiny little narrow back alleys oh it's so much fun it's like being in a maze it's like a big big historical maze <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> all fancied up because it's much more touristy city so um, but I was gonna meet some friends um, for some dragon boat thing and then it took me forever to get into the city today um, so I just kind of decided I'm gonna just have a wander um, kind of make it down to Rialto and then just see where it goes from there so welcome to Venice part two <laughs>
it, but still. and pictures and stuff like I'm literally like it's like I want to it's so hard I want to show you guys like everything but it's like almost like pictures and video like just don't cut it like you literally just have to be here like I'm trying my best but I'm like almost either like I literally video and f photo everything or like I'm like Oh, I just can't handle it. It's just so much and I'm not complaining. It's great, but it's like You know on video like every new alley is probably gonna look different but like to me it's all or I mean it'll all look the same, but it's like I don't know. Everything is just new by the way the lighting right now fantastic. I'm gonna post a couple pictures that I took or that somebody took of me actually because um, it was just the lighting was just so gorgeous right now um, anyway <laughs> but yeah this place is just like overwhelmingly like it's almost too much for me almost I don't know what I'm gonna do with myself like it's amazing <laughs> Let's go check out this city. Business funding coffee.
so much. So nice. <laughs> I mean, can you see like the painting? Look at the painting on the building. Oh my God. It's like, who does that? Who still has that? It's amazing. And it's so chilled out here. I love Italy. This is my new country. We're just, I'm just gonna move here. I'm moving Screw. in. <laughs> Screw Australia. We're just gonna live in us in uh, Italy. <laughs> when they say fair Verona, they're not joking. It's literally fair. But, well, maybe just because it's sunny. I don't know. <laughs> We got what? Ravioli tortellini? What are they calling it? Tortellini. How was your Italian tortellini? Whoa. Whoa. Mm. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. It's like a nutty taste. Ooh. Sounds delicious. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> What's the verdict? I've got to try my first ever Italian gelato. from the road. Always talk to people. I just had the most amazingly fun day and added bonus to my day trip um, by meeting um, somebody like from my campsite. We were just waiting at the bus stop together, ended up on the same train. She missed her train. We ended up hanging out all afternoon and it's been so fun. <clears throat> um, and that's like one of the perks of traveling like this is just getting to know people and like meeting people that you wouldn't normally meet um, and and just going with the flow you know so when in doubt talk talk to people make friends life lesson well, right there here we are last night I'm gonna meet a friend up for um, some dinner and then gonna go back to the campsite but one last view.